Hello, my name is To and I'm from Doncaster Library. Today I'll be sharing a very colourful story with you. This is Colour Ruse and it's written and illustrated by Anna McGregor and it's been published by Lothian. Now these are kangaroos. Normally they're not so colourful. Let's see what these guys get up to. Get this beautiful rainbows. And what have we got here? Do you know what this is? It's a map of Australia. We've got the red centre here, which is in the middle of the country. We've got the Gold Coast up here in Queensland. And then we've got the Blue Mountains here in New South Wales. Deep in the heart of the red centre lived a mob of red kangaroos. During a long, hot drought, the thirsty roos went searching for water. They hopped past the fire truck that rumbled down the dirt road. They hopped past the rusted stop sign. They hopped through the field of desert pea flowers. They hopped and hopped. But where would they stop? Meanwhile, where the blue mountains meet the sky, a mob of thirsty blue roos left their home in search of water. They hopped through the towering blue gum forest. They hopped in the cool shadows of the blue stone cottages. They hopped past a busy bowerbird decorating his nest with anything blue. Ooh, blue peg, blue lid, blue straw. They hopped and hopped, but where would they stop? Beyond the glittering skyscrapers of the Gold Coast, at a secluded beach of a golden sand, a mob of yellow roos stirred from their slumber in search of fresh water. They hopped through puffs of soft wattle. They hopped past curious cockatoos, Cockies make so much noise. They hopped along sun-drenched highways. They hopped and hopped, but where would they stop? I wonder. Oh, look here, they've all stopped. The yellow mob, the red mob, and the blue mob. What have they found? A watering hole. Each mob thought the others looked strange, but they all drank the cool water. They were all scared of dingoes. They all leapt with long legs. They all ate the juicy grass. And at nighttime, when the colour left to dance in the sky above, they were all the same. After many moons rose and fell, something extraordinary happened. I wonder what happens. Oh, joeys arrived. A purple joey, a green joey, and an orange joey, all in their mama's pouches. A red mummy roo and a yellow daddy roo had an orange joey. She liked to comb her fur, her fur by brushing up against the banksias. A yellow mummy roo and a blue daddy roo had a green joey. He liked to practice his hopping by chasing green tree frogs. A blue mummy roo and a red daddy roo had a purple joey. She liked hiding. She's hiding in the lily pilly bushes. And sometimes she hid in her mummy roo's pouch. Oh, look at how colorful it is. The young joeys played together at the waterhole, but when the drought came to an end, it was time to leave. The kangaroos had arrived as the red mob, the blue mob, and the yellow mob, and left as one happy 
colorful family. And that's the end of the story. I loved that. I loved how they created all new colored kangaroos. Oh, I'm gonna pop that one down. What have I got here? Yes, that's right, it's a rainbow. Let's sing a song about lots of different colors. Red and yellow and pink and green, purple and orange and blue. I can sing a rainbow, sing a rainbow, sing a rainbow too. I hope you enjoyed that story. See you next time. Bye.